welcome to soft reviewed uh, in this video we are going to cover the uh, rest of the integration that i did uh, mainly uh, the chat with ai function and image upscaler etc so these are some of the uh, things that i left out in my previous video uh, i hope you like it uh, now let's get to the video if you I don't know what this is this is like a service that's on a lifetime deal where you will get all of these features i have already done a review uh, on my channel if you want to watch that you can watch this video then i covered all these integration with the make uh, in this video uh, where i have left out some of the integrations uh, that i will be covering in this video uh, so let's get to the video now let's look at how we can upscale an image using the image upscaler for that i have i am using the same image that we created before it's a jpg uh, under uh, it's only around 353 kb so this is what we are using to upscale and in order to do that i have connected the uh, dropbox then uh, i am uploading the asset to one minute ai then connecting it with the image upscale i have given the path from here if you don't have the path to run this module by cutting here and run it you will get the path like this uh, this is the data that we require to map to the next module and now let's run the full scenario once i click on run it's going to the upscaler and it's upscaling the image right now and once the upscale is done we will get the full url where we can download that image to our local machine this will take some time and now the now it's finished and here as you can see uh, we have the full url uh, we need to copy the whole thing here and click on go to the image is getting downloaded here as you can see it's around 18 mb file uh, this is the uh, image that's upscaled so as you can see the clarity has now improved so that's how the upscaler works now let's look at how we can change the background of an image for that we will have to keep the source where we can upload the file and we need the assets to be uploaded to one minute ai then we need to click on the background replacer here we need two things the path if you don't see path as usual run this module alone and connecting to the dropbox then you will get the path and we need to give a prompt what we need to see in the background a woman standing in forest that can be the prompt for the background Just to make sure i am using this image so that we can replace the background as forest so the image name is image effects so we need to select that image going to remove this old one and i'm going to select this new image Just click on ok and make sure that everything is connected so we have everything that's required to run this Let's click on ok let's run this now let's wait for this to finish uh, and we have the final url just copy this and it will be downloaded to the computer and as you can see the image is now replaced with a forest now let's look at how we can chat with an image for that we need to keep everything the same then we need to select on chat with image here we need to give the prompt and the you uh, from the conversation module and the image list from the asset api these are the two things that we need so we will have to add the conversation id also in between let's add the conversation and let's connect it select the chat with image here in the conversation then give a title for this example i am giving as a youtube test select gpt forum mini now this is not where we add the uh, image this is only for adding documents don't do anything here is where we add the actual uh, image path we can use the previous image that we used for the background removal and let's for the prompt let's ask describe the image Let's keep uh, both the model same. Uh, GPT-40 Mini here and GPT-40 Mini here. And the conversation ID can we uh, we don't have it. We'll have to run it. Let's run it to get the ID. We need to map 
here i land link and the link sometimes we will have to do this as you can see still no, uh, still it's not coming here what we need to do then is save this and refresh it so the data is passed correctly this is a make bug usually this is the only fix for it so hopefully we will have the conversation as you can see we have the conversation id here click on the uuid and the prompt describe the image and that's our prompt and for the image list we can give the path from the image here this is the same image uh, we will be using the same image and we are going to ask the ai to describe what that image is so we will run this if everything is set up correctly this should work fine and we will get a description of what the image is let's get the response as you can see the image features a woman smiling and waving she has long wavy hair and wears a dark blue dress well that's correct uh, and there is also a tattoo visible on her forearm uh, the background is dark contrast and nicely uh, nicely with her attire and uh, highlights her cheerful expression uh, that correctly describes this image that's how you chat with the image if you like to see uh, how the rest of the module works i have a detailed tutorial uh, which i will pin it in the end of the video uh, you can watch it now in the end screen uh, and if you want to actually use this custom app i will have the link in the description where you can check it out as well uh, if you have more questions uh, do comment that below again thank you for watching and have a great day